While we try our best to invent a perfect and flawless program, there are always chances of messing things up and facing a bump on a smooth road. We often see bloopers at the end of a show or some YouTube video for some extra fun. Well, who said only videos and dramas can have bloopers? Even the most intelligent invention, AI, can sometimes make mistakes. So today, we are going to brighten your day with the funniest AI failures of all time. Stay tuned to watch the last one because that will definitely make you roll on your stomach. At number 5, we have Microsoft's AI chatbot Tay. With chatbots becoming popular across social networks, Microsoft released its version for users of Twitter back in March 2016, named Tay. Tay used AI to learn from digital interactions in order to have better conversations in the future. Targeting its vulnerabilities, the trolls on the microblogging website have abused Tay to make profoundly gender-based and discriminatory comments. Check out these screenshots of Tay's tweets. It will definitely make you roll. This technical backtrack led to the chat box getting deleted just within 24 hours of post-launch. Following this tragedy, Peter Lee, Microsoft's corporate vice president for AI and science, released a public apology, saying that the company had taken full responsibility for not seeing this possibility ahead of time. At number 4, we have Google Photos' AI Panorama. Almost everyone knows by now that Google Photos enhance our everyday selfies using its AI technology. Sorry, hate to break it to you, but you might not have those perfect features you think you have. The photo sharing service basically uses AI to suggest users a variety of options to choose from. You might get a trendy filter, or perhaps an animation to spice things up, or you may just get a panorama. But sometimes, when you have such a range of options available, things get messed up. A relatively obscure feature can automatically detect images with the same backgrounds and merge these into a single picture. Back in January 2018, Reddit user Alex Harker posted three photos taken during his ski trip, which Google welded into one panoramic image to make things more memorable. However, there was one teeny tiny irregularity in Google's panorama. If you look carefully between the trees, you'll see that Alex's friend's upper torso has been magnified to gigantic proportions. Well, at least Google tried to make things better. And at number 3, we have Boston Dynamics' Robot Blooper. At the 2017 Annual Congress of Future Science and Technology, leaders at UMass Lao Boston Dynamics introduced its humanoid robot, Atlas, performing cool tricks on stage. All went well right before finishing up his show of incredible dexterity in a room full of audiences as he tripped over the curtain and staggered off the stage. Check this out. So I want to show you uh, one of the robots. The latest one. Oh! Atlas picked up a box and dealt with the taunts from Spot Mini, a four-legged robot that was later featured in the demonstration. It wasn't until the final bow that Atlas had stumbled, literally. It was certainly not a planned slip. In the final upstage, Spot Mini gracefully sauntered away from the tumble. As amusing as it might seem now, the company was somehow spared instant online ridicule and became viral only after Reddit users had caught up with it. For the penultimate number two, we have Amazon's recognition. AI technology will come in handy on a variety of occasions, except this one. Amazon was seen to market its facial recognition technology to law enforcement, but the American Civil Liberties Union didn't think that was a very smart idea. Back in 2018, members of the US Congress had rained down on Amazon after their facial recognition program had wrongly matched 28 congressmen with real criminal mugshots. In fact, according to the American Civil Liberties Union, ACLU, almost 40% of the matches were people of different ethnicities, suggesting that the technology was racially biased. Unfortunately, amid these proven failures, law enforcement authorities are now seeking to use such methods to classify subjects. It is worth noting, however, that false positives are actually an accepted part of facial recognition technology. Nobody, including the ACLU, is saying police would arrest someone based on a false match alone. Facial recognition narrows down the list of suspects and then humans take over. And in at number one, we have AI World Cup 2018 predictions. The 2018 FIFA World Cup in Russia was not only intriguing for humans, but also for artificial intelligence and robots. Everyone loves making predictions, but coming from someone comparatively smarter and seemingly more reliable, people didn't mind pitching on AI technology to predict the outcome. However, before we send you any information, it is important to know that AI's prediction has given the possibility and not the certainty of an occurrence. 
To do this, the researchers simulated the event 100,000 times and used three different data processing techniques. The AI training models have shattered far too early, and like any other human-based game, the FIFA World Cup relies on many variables that decide the winner of the match after at least 90 minutes of play, which the researchers had not been able to take adequately into account. To improve the precision of the forecast, every single minute of each match could have been simulated. The team used the data from previous World Cups and evaluated them for different parameters. Although the researchers did not expect that France will win the World Cup, they gave it an 11.2% chance of becoming a world champion, which, in their defense, is not that bad after all. These were some of the funniest AI failures of all times. Which one did you find the funniest? Let us know in the comment box below. If you like this video, then don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to stay up to date for more interesting videos in the future.